in Gloucestershire, England, between the main towns of Stroud and Dursley, lies the village of Ewley. In its heyday, the village was a centre of, of industry and population. But now, with only 1,100 inhabitants, it is a small, sleepy Cotswold village. The success of the clothing industry in Ewley is owed to the many natural springs, which in turn feed into the UL. These springs provided water for the first settlers and a constant supply for the weavers. The different salts and minerals extracted from the springs and streams were used to create dyes allowing Ewley clothiers to boast an impressive range of whites, browns, all the way through to the famous Ewley blue, which, at one time, clothed the British Army. Today, one of these springs still feeds the village brewery, where its fresh natural water goes to make its renowned ales. Once famous for its 14 pubs, now only one remains in Ewley, the Old Crown. It serves a selection of ales from the local Ewley brewery. St Giles's Church, Ewley, was designed and built in the 19th century and it reflects the prosperity of the village at that time. The church replaced an earlier Norman church, which in turn replaced one of Saxon origin. For over 800 years, a parish church has stood on this hillock and presided over the village. Work started on the building that we see today in 1857 with the church being consecrated on the 28th of September 1858 by the Lord Bishop of Gloucester and Bristol. Eulyberry, the imposing flat top hill which dominates the village, used to be an Iron Age hill fort built around 300 years BC. Standing at 750 foot above sea level, this hill fort commands spectacular views over the Severn Vale. Part of it is covered by a site of special scientific interest. The sleepy village of Ewley, once a thriving local powerhouse, today has a long, varied history with plenty more to explore. <laughs>